Hey guys. Um, <laughs> ah, it's me again. So let's, um, I have something I need to share with you. Um, Lord really laid it on my heart and just one plus one equals two, right? Watch this. So in Ephesians chapter six it talks about the full armor of God, right? There's the helmet, the breastplate, the, the, the shield of faith, the sword, the, it was the word of God, the, the, the boots of the gospel of peace. And in that whole conglomerate there, that's even the right word. I don't know, but it sounds cool. So in that whole makeup, there's nothing on the backside, right? Everything is front facing. And we talked about that before, right? But watch this. Matthew chapter 16, verse 18. Jesus says, you are Peter and upon this rock, I will build my church. And the gates of Hades shall not overpower it. Now watch this. What are gates for? They're to keep people out, but they're to keep people in. Now, upon the truth of Christ, the gates of Hades will not prevail against it. Now watch this. We were called a few weeks ago to be a battleship for the Lord, right? We've got the full armor of God. Why is there nothing on our backside? Because that's where the Lord is. He's with us always, but he's also with us on us with all of the different parts of the, uh, of, of the, the armor, right? And where are we going? We're moving forward toward what? toward the gates of Hades. Listen to me. We are now on the offensive. Look around, folks. Pay attention to the news. We're seeing shootings everywhere. We're seeing craziness everywhere. We're seeing demonic spirits on the rise. I've been given a word by one of you folks that we were in a time when demons and demonic and evil spirits would be unleashed on the earth coming against Christians. And do we not see that happening? Yes. So what do we do? Recoil back and say, oh my gosh, I'm afraid. No, we move forward in the power and the authority of Christ Jesus. We are called to take back the darkness. We are called to be on the offensive. We are not waiting for Satan to attack us so that we can retaliate. We are going on the offensive the same way that Jesus went into the, into the wilderness. He was led by the spirit into the wilderness. And as he was led by the spirit into the wilderness, he went and he overcame the enemy. That's exactly what we're called to do. Folks, battleship time to your stations. Love y'all.